Well, hi there, Pluckers. I'm Sawfinger here again with you. Uh, thanks very much for joining me for another guitar lesson. This is the uh, fourth part of uh, the finger picking lessons for Kathy's song by uh, Eva Cassidy, or the Eva Cassidy version. Okay. Uh, so far, uh, up to uh, lesson three, we covered. Uh, we just finished the intro, the complete intro. Okay. So we're, we're about to go into the verse, okay, I hear the drizzle of the rain, etc. Okay, so um, if we go to our tab sheet, and if you haven't got one, you'll need one. <laughs> uh, you can download it from uh, the link in the description box underneath the video, okay. So referring to your uh, picking sheet or your tab, tab sheet, uh, we're, we've, we're looking at the uh, different lines on page one. And uh, we've got, so far, we've covered everything up to the first bar, up to and including the first bar of line five, okay? So we're just about to go into the first bar of the verse, I hear the drizzle, okay? Second bar of line five. Now, you will uh, really appreciate this, because line five, uh, bar two of line five is exactly the same as bar one of line five. So what you did on the end of line five, which uh, first bar, bar of line five, which was uh, okay, I'll do it again. Sorry. Okay, which is exactly the same as bar two on line five. So I hear the drizzle. So you've already done that bar, so um, just repeat that bar, okay? So it comes out of the, uh, the end of the solo, uh, solo, end of the intro, <laughs> sorry, I'm a bit mixed up today. slowly so coming out of the um, the end of the um, uh, I'll do it slowly so I just so break it down a bit slower That sort of thing okay so then we go into um, the first bar of line six which is in fact missing <laughs> the way it's written is not right but well, it certainly isn't as Eva Cassidy plays it anyway okay so what I'm going to tell you to do is if you learn uh, the first bar of line six as it's written uh, you'll see, or you look at it, you'll see it starts off with a double pick of uh, the third on the sixth and the open second, okay? And uh, now that's fine, now that's good, okay? Then it shows you to do an open fourth, which is good. Then it shows you to do uh, a second uh, on the third, right? Which is not right, okay? On, this, on the first bar uh, on line six, it should be open third so you should go the two together three uh, on six and open second four open three open then you hit six as it's written third and the second open as written then the open fourth as written and then every time it says two that should be an open third not fritted okay so if you play the whole bar but don't hold the second fret on the third fret just so just leave just all you need is that one finger on the sixth string okay and just do the picking pattern is okay but you don't have it fretted on the second or the third so it should sound like this okay got that so slowly okay now then so that's what that's the bit that you should be seeing. Right, so the first line of the verse is I hear the drizzle. Then this bar that I've just shown you about, of the rain. Okay, well, just 
that finger. Then, you, that's a whole bar of just that. Then you put your, then you fret the second fret of the, the uh, third string and repeat the, exactly the same picking, but you with that finger on as it's written. Okay, and that is the second bar that should be in the sixth line, shall we say? Okay, so okay, so that is right, but it's there's a missing bar with just that finger. Same picking, so first time it's second time it's. So, so far then, we should have, uh, if, you, if you can remember the missing bar, it's uh, Okay, okay, so that's what I'm saying, it's just there's a missing bar there, and it's exactly the same picking without the second fret on the third string being played. Then you, second time round, you put that finger on and play it, okay? So then we go into what's written as the second bar on line six. And uh, we've got uh, an open fifth. Now this is a sort of a, a, um, a rundown, okay? So it's, uh, I'll just play it for you. So from the beginning of the verse, it's, <coughs> See, so I start again. I hear the of the rain. So I actually hammer that. Okay, so we get into that bit. Okay, so, um, so after you come out of the. Uh, I actually end up on the fourth note. I usually, on the, where it shows you the line uh, bar one of line six, before it goes into the next bar, I usually leave off that two on the uh, third string, the very last one. I tend to just miss that off altogether, okay? So, Don't play that last third that's shown, okay? Because then, it, 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 otherwise, you, it, the next chord change gets sometimes fluffed because <laughs> it's very, you know, you don't have enough time, okay? Uh, so I lift that, I leave that one off, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, so from that missing bar, finger on. Then we go into this A minor. Now it shows you uh, with um, there's different ways you can play this. The way it's written is um, okay, something like that. I tend to hammer. Okay, I just it's just a personal preference. It's not written as a hammer. It's so if you look at it as it's written, bar nine six bar two is open fifth A minor. Take a uh, make an A minor shape. Well, it doesn't say that, but it's an A minor shape. Okay, so A minor shape. Play the fifth open, second string, fourth string, third string, open fifth again. And again, first, uh, first round, the second string, fourth, third. So it's okay. Okay, so that's okay. Now, what I personally do is I, I do tend to do that, but do it as it's written. It's not. It's not. It's probably okay. I just a personal thing. Okay. 
And then basically what I tend to do is I take this finger and I put this, that finger, leave those two where they are, like an A minor seventh, if you like, and I put my third finger on the third fret of the sixth string again. And this is this is where they change. They're they're different again here. I tend to leave that fretted on this first fret of the second string. They're showing it as open. So um, after the A minor bit. So I prefer that rather than I think that's wrong personally. So I think it should be third on the sixth. So after your A minor, put that thing, take that finger off and put it up there, and then hit the third on the sixth, the first on the second, then the fourth string, then the second string, then the th sixth string, then the first string, second string, sorry, second string again, then uh, the fourth, and then the uh, third again. So what I think that should be is okay. So that doesn't agree with them, but that's me. <laughs> if you want to play it their way, it sounds like um, like this. I don't really. I don't think that's right. I don't think that's right. I can't even play it. I don't think that's right. I think it should be. Okay, so I'll do that slowly, the way I play it. So, it says written, the first half is correct. Then third, move that finger up to the third on the sixth, then play third on the sixth, first on the second, so the second string, so sixth string, second string, uh, whilst holding that shape, fourth string, third string, sixth string, first, second string, fourth string, third string, so, I think at that point, I think we'll leave it. Um, uh, we'll, keep it we'll keep these lessons relatively short, I think. So, um, so far we've got this. I'm com coming out of the, uh, the, end, the last part of the intro. So um, that's it. So I'm going to do the whole thing uh, right from as far as we got. Okay. So I say it's uh, when you slow it down, it's harder to play slower down. It is faster. Funny enough, it's weird. Okay. sound something like that. I say it changes every time I play it. <laughs> Things get left in, uh, left added and some gets left out but uh, you know it keeps flowing that's the main thing. Anyway thanks very much for watching and listening and uh, that's about halfway through the verse now so uh, we're getting there. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in, uh, in the next lesson. Okay bye for now.